Hello everyone, yo boy Dilcrafts here, and welcome back to another reaction. So today, we'll be reacting to SML movie, Mr. Poorman. So, this came out just recently, and like, about an hour ago. So the description says, Mr. Goodman needs to be poor. For what? I don't know, I thought he hates being poor. Um, anyways, we're gonna find out. What's it all about? Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications. And there might be two reactions matchups scheduled tomorrow. This one and the recent SMO reaction matchup. Um, I gotta see. So other than that, I hope you guys enjoy. And let's begin. up your spongebob book jeffy look and see for yourself notice anything wrong with it uh they're not underwater no spongebob has two tongues he's got one down here and one up here licking his eyeball he does have two tongues that's so uh, silly it's not silly mommy this is serious that's weird business. this is a colossal fuck up he's officially licensed by spongebob squarepants you know how many people this had to go through before it hit the shelves someone's getting fired today unless they can confirm that spongebob actually does have two tongues and then i'll get over it jeffy just calm down and read your book no because i'm gonna call nickelodeon and fire somebody after i get a piece of my mind <sighs> there's someone at the door hmm. hello hey marvin i need your help what do you need help with goodman you're poor right yeah well i need you to teach me <laughs> how to be poor teach how to be poor why well i just found out that i have another kid down in mexico or some shit and the mom's wanting me to pay her five million dollars a month in child support i didn't know talk to Damn. Was that expensive i mean i can afford it i just don't want to so what i did was is i moved all my money to an offshore bank account and then now i have to live off the least amount of money as possible for the next few months while the judge goes through my bank accounts because i don't want him to see that i have a lot of money so i need your help to teach me how to be poor well i mean i'm really busy just I not have have a lot of money I'll pay you ten thousand dollars I mean sure yeah I can teach you how to be poor so rule number one don't give people money because poor people can't afford to give people money well if I don't give you money then how am I gonna get you to do what I want you to do by being nice ew poor and uh, the, the next rule is come here <laughs> yeah, so basically. another thing you can do to be more poor is not drive a Lamborghini not drive a Lamborghini what else am I supposed to drive a bicycle ew! drive like a Mitsubishi no, no, you, drive a bicycle. you can drive a car you just need something more poor hmm more poor I know exactly what you mean I'm gonna go buy one uh, okay let's see where's Goodman at what the <laughs> yeah yeah Poor. Mm hmm. That's a poor car, all right. <laughs> all right, Marvin. I did what you said. I bought a poor car. This is not a poor car. It's expensive. It literally has the word poor in the name. It's a Porsche. What? It's still expensive. <laughs> Listen, Marvin, I can't go any lower than this. It's already shitty. What? It's not a shitty car. This is really nice. No, it is shitty. It's Porsche. It's poor shitty. And it's offensive because it was named after George Bush. A 911. It's a Porsche 911. <sighs> oh, okay, fine. So you're saying this is the cheapest car you'll go? Yeah, I can't do anything less than this, Marvin. It's shitty. <sighs> okay. Okay, well, at least it's a start. You got rid of the Lamborghini, so let's go work on some other stuff. All right. Hey, baby, I need what? You, you could have used well, Jeffy's car before they destroyed it. Teach him how to be poor. Wait, he spent $10,000 to learn how to be poor? Yeah, I already told him that poor people can't hand out money. Okay, good. And I told him that poor people can't drive a Lamborghini. Okay. So what other things can we teach him to be poor? Well, poor people don't walk around everywhere in a nice suit, so you're going to have to change your clothes. You want me to get rid of my elephant asshole? suit 75 endangered african elephants were poached for their assholes to make this suit this suit cost me 55 million dollars i take a bath in it i don't know why that's so funny well why don't you sell it if you make the money <laughs> sell it i will never sell the suit i will be buried in this suit well how about you just take it off because if the judge sees you walking around in a 55 million dollar suit he's gonna make you pay child support you're right. So what am I supposed to wear to be poor? All right, look, I'll pick out a poor outfit. Come on. 
All right, baby, I picked out an outfit for him. I look like old McDonald without his farm. No, I think you look <laughs> nice. E-I-E, -E, I know I don't. I look like I smell bad. If a kid said, hey, Dad, does that man smell bad? He's going to say, yes. Yes, he does. Stay away from him. He's stinky. My name's Mr. Goodman, not Mr. Goodwill. Well, Goodwill's where we got the outfit <laughs> from. And it smells like the person who owned it before me shit my pants. Well, look, it only cost five dollars. Well, I would pay five dollars not to wear this. Well, look, when the judge sees you wearing this, he's not gonna make you pay child support. Yeah, you're right. He's probably gonna feel bad for me and make the woman pay me child support. Well, that's what we're going for, right? Oh, I guess. Oh, I'm getting kind of hungry. How does he on. even know, know that he had uh, oh, another chive. kid? Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. All right, sir. Here is your eight ounces. Could it be that maid? Cooked medium rare. Are you sure it's eight mm. ounces? Because it looks more like seven. I can assure you that it's eight, sir. I weighed it before I cooked it. it looks like a nice dinner. Sounds like seven. No, well, sir. When you cook meat, it doesn't. Sounds like so seven. Oh, I'm not listening. Chives, did you take a bite out of my carrot? It was more of a nibble, sir. What is that, Chives? A nibble carrot, sir. You nibbled my carrot, put it back on my plate. Well, I had to make sure that it was cooked thoroughly. Well, next time, eat the f***ing thing. Get out of here, Bugs Bunny. Yes, sir, but before I go, I must ask. Why are you dressed like a farmer? Ask Marvin. Well, Goodman wants to act poor for a few months. Ha! Good luck with that. Well, Goodman, you can't eat all this. Yes, I can. I'm a growing boy. Well, no, no, I meant like <laughs> poor people don't eat this kind of food. A growing poor guy poor is likely. No. I'm gonna starve. What am I supposed to eat then? Well, look, I will go cook you a meal that poor Hamburger. Do not eat this. McDonald's. If you look good for the judge, do not eat food like this. Hold on. <sighs> all right, Goodman, I made you dinner. Are you eating your steak? No, it was a fly. There's no way a fly took that <laughs> big a bite. Yes, he did. He was a big old bastard. Listen, Goodman, here's <laughs> your ramen noodles. Instant yes, sir. Lunch? Ew, poor, what is this? It's called ramen noodles, and it's really cheap, but it's really good. Who's ramen, and why do I have to eat his noodles? Because it's really cheap, and it's really good. Try it. And what is this? A Rice Krispie Treat? What? No, that's what the noodles looks like before you cook it. It looks like dried worms. Ew, <laughs> you're trying to poison me. Help, help, Chives. He's trying to poison me. What's going on, sir? He's trying to make me eat ramen's noodles. Well, that's what I had for lunch today, sir. Oh, no. Somebody call poison control. Chives has been poisoned. Well, it's it's actually pretty good, sir. Oh, no. The worms must be eating your brain and making you delusional. Help! Oh, good, then listen. Everyone eats ramen noodles. Oh, really my good. God. Look, you can't keep calling your butler because poor people don't have butlers. Well, if I can't call my butler, then who's going to wipe my ass? You. Ew! My hand has got to go near my ass. Poor! <laughs> Listen, poor people wipe their own butt, so tell your butler you'll see him in a few months. <sighs> Chives, go to your room in the basement and I'll be home in a few months. Very well, sir. Marvin, 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 what's with all this screaming? He's trying to feed me worms! Ooh, ramen? How does everyone know who ramen is and his worms? I love ramen! <laughs> well, I hate being poor. I can't drive my Lamborghini. I have to dress like Ronald McDonald. I have to eat ramen's worms. And what's next? You're gonna tell me I have to wash my own clothes? Yeah. Ah, I gotta go lay down. Oh, no, no, no. I can't do this anymore. I can't do this. Come on, Goodman. You can do this. Don't call me Goodman. Call me poor man because that's what I am. Well, if you can't do this, then you have to pay that woman $5 million a month in child support. I'm not paying her $5 million a month. That kid's not worth it. That's a lot of money, Marvin. Well, if you don't want to pay it, then you got to learn how to be poor. <sighs> All right. I guess you're right, Marvin. Just go give me some water and let me clear my head. Uh, uh, Voss water, sparkling, please. No, poor people don't drink sparkling Voss water. Fiji? No. Evian? No, we drink water from the sink. Ah! Like where the toilet is? Or the kitchen sink. Yeah, it's all the same shit. It's pipes in the house. Ew, poor. Listen, it's called tap water. Well, I'm tapping out. Well, listen, <laughs> you've got to drink stuff like that if you want to be poor. Well, what's other stuff they can do to save money? Well, what do you spend most of your money on? Well, my haircut costs $20,000. Well, why is that haircut $20,000? Because three naked girls cut my hair while giving me pina coladas. Well, we're not doing that anymore. Uh, my haircut should only cost $20. $20? They're whatever. Stab me in the eye with scissors or something. That doesn't usually happen. Uh, what else do you spend your money on? $20,000 for a haircut? That's crazy, man. Submarine, but that guy hasn't called me back. I think he's ignoring me. Okay, look, you can't buy stupid stuff like that. And if you're gonna buy stuff, you have to go cheap. 
Oh, so you're telling me not to take my big private jet, I gotta take my little one. No, no private jets. Poor people don't have private jets. Well, then how am I supposed to fly to Paris for lunch? You're not gonna fly to Paris for lunch, and if you have to fly, you're gonna fly cheap, like Spirit Airlines. Cheap? I'm not gonna fly cheap when I'm flying through the air. Look, it's called Spirit Airlines. It's a nice airline. Well, if I fly Spirit Airlines, I'm gonna turn into a spirit. Listen, it's just what you gotta <laughs> do to be poor. Wait, my phone's ringing. It's my son Richard calling. Hello? Hey, Dad, me and my friends are down here in Orlando trying to rent out Disney World for the day, and they're telling me that it costs $4 million, but my credit limit's only $3 million. So can you give me the other million? Hold on, Richard. My son, he's in trouble. He's down in Orlando trying to rent out Disney World for the day, and they told him that it's going to be $4 million, and his credit limit's only $3 million. So do I give him the other million? No! But he'll yell at me. No, you got to tell him no. You're poor. But I don't want him to yell at me. You, who cares? You're poor now. Tell him but no. But it's, it's his Fuck. son. Richard? No. What the f Dad? Y'all down here in Orlando with my friends trying to rent out Disney World? And you're gonna tell me fing no? Will you want me to be poor? That's embarrassing. You want me to be embarrassed when I go back to school and be poor? Oh, hold on, Richard. Richard, no, you're not getting that other million dollars. I'm putting my foot down. I'm gonna increase your credit limit, okay? I love you. Bye. I put my foot down, I'm not gonna give him that million dollars. See, good, you told him no. What'd he say? He said he was fine with it, that he understood. Okay, well, I don't think he should have a $3 million credit limit. I think he should lower it to like $100. I agree, and I'll tell him that later. Okay, so, look, we're saving money already. Okay, so let's go teach you how to unclog a toilet. What? Marvin, good news! Why not waste, like, almost all toilet. of his it's money, good, so... so look, sometimes he he up, would be actually it, poor. Push it down with the no, I, yeah, I don't know. What? I'm just gonna pay the woman five million dollars a month in child support. Why? Because I don't want to be a caveman and push my shit down the toilet with a stick. You only have to do that to get stuck. <laughs> oh great, yeah, I'm definitely done. So enjoy dressing like a farmer, enjoy eating Roman's worms, and enjoy being poor. You taught me to feel worse for poor people. So now when I see them on the side of the road, I'm just gonna drive by them faster and enjoy the ten thousand dollars. I'm done here. So, Marvin, what are we going to do with the $10,000? I have no idea. Hey, Danny, I called Nickelodeon about this SpongeBob situation. And what'd they say about the two tongues? They said one's for the pink and one's for the stink. What? Yeah, they told me that if I wanted to change, that I'd have to pay to have it republished. So how much would that cost? $10,000. Jeffy, no. <laughs> what would you do if you were a billionaire? Man, you already know. Gonna, I'm gonna buy mansions for my whole family. Uh, I could have my own one. Uh, my mother could have her own. Just like every one of my family members could have their own individual mansion. And also, I could buy them Lamborghinis, uh, Rolls Royce, uh, all of that. Oh man, imagine if I was that rich. Oh, I would have been be in this apartment it would be in a big mansion in like LA or something it's crazy I always wanted to go to like Florida LA stuff like that or Boston but yeah um anyways what would you do if you were a billionaire comment down below and uh, credits goes to SML Logan whatever and old, an old credit credits to the original and other than that i hope you guys enjoy and i will see you in the next video goodbye everyone